So that's why for me, it's like even like regardless of who's president, like you said before, it doesn't impact our lives directly. But like you got to vote your interest and you got to like vote, period. And I feel like for me, how do you feel after you vote? How do I feel after I vote? After you vote and for all this change and, 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 and something that you want and you really believe in and, and it doesn't happen. How do you feel after that? You want to be honest how I feel after I vote? Yeah. I, I don't feel anything. Oh, all right. Cool. Me neither. I don't feel anything. <laughs> but like people, bro. I don't feel anything after I vote. Like nothing. Do you feel like you made a difference? I felt or like do you feel like you did your duty. I felt like I did what I had to do as a citizen. Yeah, and do you, That's feel, what that, I feel. Do you feel like you made a difference in that? Uh no. <laughs> but I will always vote. I will never not vote. That's yo, it's so funny, bro. Given the opportunity, I will I never don't know not why vote. I want to talk about this so much. But because last year, I believe it was last election, I was living in LA, so I didn't like go through the hoops of getting like a, a absentee vote. A, 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 proxy. A, yeah, proxy joint. Mm-hmm. Um and I had told my roommate. At the time, I was like, "Yo, like it's pointless." Like I'm like, like I don't want to say it's pointless. I don't like. Hear me out. Oh, go ahead, go ahead. Right. Uh huh. I was like, "Yo, it's pointless." Like, like I'm not gonna vote. It doesn't really matter. Right. Okay. Hmm. Which I truly believe deep down inside. Okay. I really, really believe that. Now, only because, like, fam, look who's our president. I understand that, but. You're you're thinking about that in a very uh very like selfish individual way, and when a group well, they of tell you your vote counts, and when it, no, but I mean it 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 definitely counts. Like the the numbers count, it counts. You know what I'm saying? But like if if people think that way in the mat, like the 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 large number of people that think that their vote doesn't matter or that it's not going to make a difference makes a difference. Trev makes a difference in the long run. I understand that, but yeah. you got to show me. You got to show me. I want to see direct results. Yo, I voted for this and this this program, this whatever. Uh-huh. And this is what we got. I mean, for direct results, it's... for direct. I want to res- see, see direct results. For direct local results, like you got to vote locally and you got to follow up. It's that, like anything. Okay, so that's where it counts. Yeah, but when yeah, we yeah, talk yeah. about the nation, all 50 states, and we want to vote for health care, we want to vote for student loans, uh-huh. we want to vote for... for Accurate pay and this is the equal pay. Da, 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 da. Mm-hmm. Like, show me results on my vote. I think it's so. Show me that my vote counts. I have not seen that my vote counts. So I'm sure neither of us do this, but like it, it takes for that. It takes like so so much intense follow up to see what the progress of your vote is, what your single vote is, whether it's for a mayor or a governor or even a president. It takes like intense follow-up on like legislation that was passed, legislation that was denied, uh, legislation that was voted on. It takes like such intense follow-up. None of us do it. None of us have the time. No. None of us have the the energy, the shit, even me, like the mental capacity to understand it or do it or fight through it. So I get where so I get where you're coming from where you feel like there's there's no difference or there's no change and the worst thing would be is that if we put in that time and that energy to look into the great detail of like every single vote and what every single legislation that passes is and we still see no result. And that's and and honestly that's why I have to give it up to like local politicians and like local organizers because that's their job every day. Yeah. It's their job every day to go out there and put some shit on the table that gets shut down. Shut down, shut down, shut down, shut down. Shut down. And still keep pushing. Like these motherfuckers in the Bronx or in East New York or um, Camden or Newark. <laughs> like these people that are working in these neighborhoods that are consistently shitty. Consistently fucked up. Yeah. And they know exactly how to fix this neighborhood. They know what it needs, the resources and everything because they're in the fucking like ground level. Like there are some like community organizing politicians that are really like working like blood, sweat and tears. Yeah, And they're looking at the results and seeing nothing and not getting the support that they counts. know that they need that's and that's where it, where counts. it counts in our neighborhoods but like but i think we have to i'm sorry to cut you off, but I, I think we have to have that similar mentality when it comes to like voting and follow-up and i think that's the only way that we see change and there's such a small percentage of the population that does that like i don't do that the way that i should i know you don't do that the way that you should right. most of the people we know don't do that the way that we should the people that do you know where they live they live in suffolk county they live in garden city yeah they live in those neighborhoods. Because it affects their taxes. It affects their tax, their property taxes, yeah, and the yeah, values yeah. of their homes. And they're on it. 
and they take that seriously and they're at the community meetings and they're at the board meetings and they're at the the homeowners association meetings and they're at all these other different fucking places that we would rather not be at or they're forming these organizations yeah. that we would rather not form and i get it and it's and it's not a black it's an average thing like the average person is more concerned about like them going to work coming home cooking dinner making sure the kids are good making sure the wife is good making sure the husband is good and we're in our bubble of our lives and as long as our lives are good or comfortable yeah, really, yeah. we are happy but if we're going to like be altruistic and think hey like i want this for my community i want that for my community then we got to do that shit and we ain't willing to do that shit 